Hi everyone, this is Nataraj. Welcome back to that CloudRoot channel. Today I am going to talk about that way to restart the deployment pod using kubectl command. So there are the four way to restart your deployment pod. So we will be see one by one. The first one is the kubectl rollout that restart the command. So this command will be restart the pod and managing by that deployment. Next one is that kubectl delete the deployment pod. So this method involving that deleting the existing pod and then recreating the newer one. So this pod will be recreating with the same configuration. Third one kubectl scaling command. So this method involving that scaling the pod to zero then scaling back to with the original number of the replicas. So this is the will be effective restarting that pod. The fourth one is the kubectl rollout that undo command. So this command will be that undo the last rollout and recreating the pod with the previous configurations. So we will be moving to the terminal, I will be executing this command and I will be show to you how it will be that will be work. I am at the terminal, so I am going to create that deployment object. So here I am going to deploy that ingenious application. Later on that only we will be start on that methoding operation. So first I will going to deploy that ingenious application with the help of that uh, kubectl command kubectl create deployment nginx restart just i'm assigning the name then i can provide that image equal to nginx if i execute this one so now uh, deployment command is executed so let's see that how many pod is running on it in our case it will be running on that one pod so i'll use the kubectl command get pod now one pod is up and running in the method one we are going to performing that rollout that restart the deployment so kubectl rollout restart the deployment and we have to provide that the name of the deployment object so here i am copy and paste this one yes now you can see the thing it be showing as the command is executed now it be seeing that output is be restarted just you can executing that uh, kubectl get pod command yeah you can see the thing that uh, name of the pod so earlier it be 76 now it will be 56 we will be moving to that method 2 method 2 we are performing with the deleting operation kubectl delete the pod and the pod name you have to provide just enter the command yeah now command is executed so now we deleted the pod immediately you can execute that uh, kubectl pod command now the new pod is appear yeah you can see that uh, the pod naming convention so uh, in the top hs 9px here n 96l8 so we are uh, completed that method to operation now we will be see on the method 3 operation so just again executing that uh, uh, kubectl scaling replica option so kubectl scale hyphen hyphen replica equal to 0 and then you can provide the deployment object then deployment object name so here i provide a restart Yeah, now it be scaled. Again, you can execute that kubectl pod command. Yeah, there is a no resources running on. Just you can execute the same command with the, along with that value one. So I am replacing the zero to one. Now scaled. So again, execute the pod command. Now the new pod is up and running. This is effective way to restarting the pod. Then we are moving to that method 4, kubectl rollout and undo the deployment and provide the nginx hyphen restart. Now we are roll, roll back. So just I am executing the kubectl pod command. Now you can see the thing the pod value will be changed. 
so this is a way we can able to restart the pod i hopefully this video will be useful to everyone thanks for watching bye